Ben's 30th birthday. I'm on my way to collect his cake first. His favorite cake is red velvet cake. I ordered one from Hummingbird. I just have to go collect it from Portobello Road. What do we think about my natural makeup? I'm not used to seeing my lashes like this. I usually get lash extensions or I'm wearing uh, strip lashes. Thank you. But um, today I was in the mood for, you know, just barely anything. <laughs> gonna collect his cake and then drive to his mom's and we're gonna have some cake together lunch together and in the evening i'm taking my boyfriend out all right i'm here oh mg yes right in front of the porsche <laughs> oops all right let's go let's pick it up <laughs> type for surprise parties by the way he told me not to throw him once i'm just happy that even if he doesn't like it i'm not to be blamed for so that's a good thing back from china and she brought us some jasmine tea i'm so excited these are the things that make me happy hi everyone a different setting today i know um today i didn't feel like going to the actual gym so i decided to come work out in our home gym i feel like i haven't talked to you guys a lot this week it was my boyfriend's 30th birthday and went to the gym with Ella the other day. So I'm starting with 10 minutes of running just to warm up a little bit. And then I'm gonna do a couple leg exercises. I'm much more productive when I'm in the actual gym because one, um, you're surrounded with people that also work out. Two, there's way more machines that you can use. And three, you came all the way there. So you put like extra effort in it been three minutes already so seven more minutes I just finished my leg workout and I've decided to do 10 more minutes of running or walking yesterday I made some meal prep for the week I made chicken with pasta pesto but a spicy one you guys know me I always eat my pasta spicy by the way guys I hate chicken thighs like especially and it's sad because I love the Asian cuisine, especially the East Asian cuisine. Um, but I feel like they prefer using chicken thigh rather than chicken breast. Because obviously chicken breast is dry and chicken thigh has more fat to it. And fat makes it more tasty to some people. But it's the consistency for me. Like, I don't like when the chicken is gluey, you know. I prefer it very dry. And that's why I usually go for chicken breast. Let me know what you guys prefer, chicken breast or chicken thigh. Tomorrow, gotta wake up early, do the washings, have breakfast, then go collect stuff. 
and also drop something off and then I decided to go to a cafe um, I just need to find one where I can charge my laptop or my iPad depending on what I'm taking it needs to be a cozy cafe I heard there's one in Mayfair um, I think I'm gonna test that one out because they close around 10 p.m. which is really good cafes that close late have my heart literally like if I ever own a cafe my cafe will close late that's for sure I would love to be a member in a cafe that you know like only allows people with a membership to enter after a certain time just like to have it more secure especially being a woman uh, late at night if you guys know any cafes with memberships just let me know in the comments um, I would love to sign up to one. I was thinking to cut my hair. Please talk me out of it because it took me long to get my hair this. Oh my god, I don't want to fall on camera. But yeah, this is the length right now. I cut my hair like two weeks ago, just the end bits. But it's very healthy and it looks good. Like I'm not um, complaining about the way it looks. But I feel like if it was like up to here and then you do like a you know um bouncy blowout hairstyle it could look more i don't know more classy it's been more than 10 minutes already it's been 11 minutes so talking to you guys is actually very productive there you go hold on <laughs> over 11 minutes the relief i need to massage my scalp it's wow so tense I lost two of my press-on nails in the gym today. <laughs> Guys, I'm super tired. Um, yeah, I think I'm gonna make myself a tea and then go sleep and wake up early in the morning. All right, time to do my hair. happy with it and um wait let me focus on here yeah. yeah today was my hair wash day i oiled my scalp um using rosemary oil and left it in for like three hours and then wash it out with some um, cleansing shampoo and then normal shampoo i use kerastase at the moment when i had like balayage you know like bleached hair i was using um olaplex and it was really good i was happy with it but because i'm not blonde anymore I felt like it was too harsh on my brown hair so I switched to Kerastars now I can definitely recommend Olaplex for all my blondies I decided to get ready and drive to Central um, there's like a cafe that closes late so I wanted to check that one out by the way I would love to know how old you are like I just want to know if you guys are in your 20s or in your 30s and if you are in your 30s and you're from London what are the things that you do on weekends like I haven't went out like to a club in literally a year or something or maybe even longer and for the past I would say three years I haven't even been enjoying it I would much rather go to a jazz bar I would much rather go to a cafe and I don't know just like dining and a wine bar this is like this is my life now I'm gonna continue filming when I get there and show you guys the cafe that I picked for today
So I just had blank street coffee and something to eat, like a little muffin with um, egg, cheese and spinach. It was really good. And now I'm going to the cafe that I actually wanted to go to, the one that closes late. It's Mayfair. Mm -hmm. 